We've gotten some new sources and leaks that I think you might be interested in. Let's talk. Before we get into this video, I'd like to let y'all know that I'm doing a giveaway for an LTI Argo Atlas. In order to participate, all you have to do is be subscribed and leave a comment in any video between now and the end of December. Let's get into this video. All right, guys, we've gotten some new leaks. As usual, it's really interesting stuff. Just let y'all know, take every leak video with a grain of salt as things may change. Things may not actually happen. So just to remind you guys, okay? So now the very first leak that we've gotten is um, the paints, the paints for the Zeus. It seems like they're going to have black steel and orange uh, livery, um, blue, black, white, green, black, yellow, a Halloween 2024 uh, blood skin, uh, metal, black, white, orange, gray, black, and a VIP pale blue, gold, black, and a white, gray, black, and a yellow, black, yellow livery for the Zeus's. Okay, so that's going to be really cool to see. All right, so let's get into the Crusader Intrepid. You guys are going to butcher me again for, for pronouncing it wrong again, but uh, Intrepid, right? <laughs> All right, um, Crusader Intrepid, it says here um, there is a fridge door left and right. There's a toilet, there's a bench. Man, that's that's a lot of space, man. Is this, this thing's actually going to be a starter ship? It seems like it would be, right? It has a weapon rack. It has a um, bed single, right? So it has a single bed. I think it is. It is. It definitely is a starter ship, but it seems like it has a lot of amenities for the player. All right. Next is going to be the Mark II version of the Hornet. There's going to be an F7CM, an F7CR, an F7CS Mark II versions. Okay. So that's pretty cool. One that really threw me off that I did not expect is going to be a Xi'an drone. Did not expect that. Um, Xi'an drone. So is this, it seems like it's either going to be a single seater fighter, um, Xi'an ship, or it's actually going to be a drone, a legitimate drone that you have to remote control. So we'll have to see once uh, we hear more about that. Up next is the Mirai Guardian Mohawk. So now the word Mohawk, we're not too sure what the Mohawk means. Is that a variant? I'm not sure. But you'll, 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 you'll see as I go through it that Mohawk will be mentioned a lot more, um, which uh, would say that it's actually not a variant, but it means something else. So let's continue. Argo a CSV has a camera drone hatch. So the Argo CSV has a drone hatch. And it seems like there's going to be a camera view for the drone hatch. So when you release the drone, um, it also has a cargo rack. It has cargo rack top. It also has CSV drone bay placeholder. And it also has a roof cap. Really interesting. Now, I'm really interested. Is CIG going to finally release how drones will work in the game? Because I'm seeing a lot of drone stuff lately, right? We'll have to see. Hopefully... We do see it because it's been a while. All right. So next is the RSI Zeus Collar Bounty. RSI Zeus Collar Bounty L and Bounty Right. So I think L, it says L and R. So right and left. So maybe this, this has to do with the MR maybe, right? I'm not too sure. But then there is an RSI Zeus Mohawk Bounty. So what is Mohawk? right is that like a, a skin it might be a skin right yeah so it says mohawk bounty rsi zeus mohawk passenger and rsi zeus uh spoiler passenger says here not sure what any of this means but uh yeah so um in regards to mohawk it seems like mohawk has been mentioned a lot for a lot of the the ships in, in in the xml's so just looking through to see if there's anything interesting so i'm seeing uh, a shadow cast distance and um there's a name saying beauty mohawk rare projector and then beauty mohawk rare points so what do these things mean and then navigation red strobe mohawk point so what is mohawk this is this is really interesting Okay, I'm not seeing hardpoint mohawk loadout. 
Does it have to do with a hard point? This is interesting. It's either a legitimate thing or CIG is just trolling us because they know we're going to find the leaks, right? So <laughs> this may mean not, absolutely nothing. All right, so let's continue. Um, all right, so now, um, remember in the previous uh, leak video, I mentioned a passenger Zeus variant. So it seems like it possibly might be called a RSI Zeus ST. All right, so which may be the passenger variants, the ST variant. So let's move on. So jump points, it seems like in Pyro we'll be seeing multiple jump points. So there will be a jump point for Pyro to Kano, Pyro to Castra, Pyro to Hadrian, Pyro to Nyx, Pyro to Oso, Pyro to Stanton and Pyro to Terra. So um, really interesting. So I guess once we get Pyro, I wonder, will we see those jump points already in as assets once we get our hands on Star Citizen Alpha 4.0? I wonder. All right, so now next will be uh, the Zeus passenger. So more on the passenger variant. It says uh, cargo grade left, cargo grade right, um, Zeus spoiler passenger. What is that? And then Zeus winglet passenger left. Interesting. Okay, so now they're suspecting the RSI Zeus ST um, with the ST meaning status. So we'll have to see. We'll, we'll have to see if this is any of this is actually true, but um, we'll have to see. All right, next is the Crusader Spirit E1 exterior XML and then Crusader Spirit E1 exterior nose XML. So the question is, will we be seeing the Spirit? this citizen con or iae i think we may see the the uh e1 spirit this iae i think i think we'll probably see it during IAE. that's my guess all right so next is the amber hornet f7 cm mach 2 heart seeker so this is probably going to be a skin for it and an interesting one um, at the end here is the Aegis Reclaimer Drone XML. So I'm hearing a lot about drones. I think CIG may be ready to reveal more information about drones based on these leaks. Well, you guys let me know your thoughts on all the things that we just spoke about. Before I let you go, I'd like to let y'all know that my organization, Phase 1 Industries, is now recruiting new and veteran players. If you are interested, you can find our Discord in the description down below. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one.